Hey guys, welcome to another level two algebra skills video here. We're going to be looking at logs, just uh, some uh, tricks and tips to kind of work through it. So as you kind of have realized this, if you're following this playlist, that you would know what this two things up here in front of me are. One is the exponent form and the other is the log form. But just in terms of um, just some ideas, right, with uh, some basic kind of ideas. Now let's take, uh, if we take any number, whatever that number is, and if we raise it to the power of zero, we are going to get one as the answer, right? So this is true with any number. So if we were to look at this in log form, then what happens is that you've got log, uh, the base is B in this case, and then the answer is equal to one. So, which means our power is actually gonna to equal to zero. So it's just something to kind of remember. And also remember that any number that you take, and if you raise it to the power of one, you're also going to get the same number again. So if you think about it this way, then you've got log of the base B with the answer then equals to one. So just remember that that's, that B is there is your base. And then the green colored B is your answer. And of course, your powers are going to be sticking outside. Now in the previous example, we actually looked at this right here. So we actually said log of 100 and we actually put that in the calculator and we actually got it as two and the reason we got that as two was because the calculator puts a little base of 10. so i guess what i wanted to talk to you guys about was what if i wanted to have a base that's not actually 10. so say for example um, this number here so if i go log 2 of 64. now if and if i put that as x now i know what the answer already in this case is because i know that uh, because 2 is the base and x is the power, I can put that as 64. I also know that uh, 64 can be written as 2 to the power of 6, therefore x is equal to 6. But how do we do this in the calculator? So what we can do is in the calculator, it's, it's not a any kind of major kind of trick, but it, it's surprisingly it still works. But if you ever want to calculate log uh, 2 of 64, then what you can actually do is just type in log of 64 divided by log of 2, and that actually gives us the answer of 6. All right? So now you're thinking, but hang on, hasn't that got a base of 10? Um, yes, it does have a base of 10, but it's just a different kind of um, uh, way of working out. And as you do more logs and watch, keep watching the videos, things will start to make a bit of sense. So let's try one more question here. So I think I put up this question earlier of um, when is 2 to the power of x equals to uh, 10? Well, we can rewrite this in log form. So when we rewrite this in log form, we're going to get log 2 of 10 equals to x, which means we can write this as uh, log 10 divided by log 2, which is going to give us whatever that x uh, value is. So I'm going to go in log 10 divided by log 2. Now remember I told you it's going to be between 3 and 4 because 2 to the power of 3 is 8, 2 to the power of 4 is 16, and in this case you can see that x is equal to 3.322. Now I might have actually jumped a gun here guys in terms of showing you this, but um, this is just some of tips and uh, tricks for calculations that you can actually use in logs. Well that's basically it for this uh, little video guys. As always, don't forget to like and share this video and also subscribe to keep up with the latest content. There should be some playlists coming up with some previous skills and exam papers. Go check them out and thank you for watching.